once you have that kind of, I would say, maybe five really good, strong keywords that you think your item might be, then I go into marmalade, right? And I get, and I check. And I used this example with you guys the last time because it got more shocking since then. I'm from Northern Pennsylvania, and we call the things around light switches, switch plate covers. That's what they are. And I swear, I was doing my work, and, and I literally, there were no other words for it. I'm like, what would it be? And it has low engagement, and it has 112,000 views per month. And that's everything. That's not just vintage. That's every person that is searching for switch plate covers. And using, I used the storm and I used the search and it said that um, light switch covers has moderate engagement, which is quite better. And um, 476,000 views, which is 364,000 views more than switch plate covers. And literally there's no way for me to tell that in Etsy, right? Like, you can find seed keywords. You can figure out how to best position yourself in Etsy's ecosystem. But then to find out that, that your strongly held belief in what things are called is wrong, you have to do that search either in, Etsy, in Marmalade or I guess you could go look at them, but I don't know how you would find the views. So. Yeah.